moves there, then leaps into the pool. Whee! Huh? Bye, I'm going for a swim. He's booking it. These two, seeing him book it, leap off and into the water. What the fuck can they just leap that for? Aren't they halfway up the cliff? They push off the cliff and they like they push off the cliff They're jumping. Normal. And into the water. Pr pretty much more, they like just stop climbing and slide down into it. We are sliding down takes less time. Anyways, if we are out of combat, I mentally go like, well, I just like inform the others. There's probably, I mean, with Zaren, we realize that it, the picture is probably depicted uh, ritual to be a lich. So there's probably a lich down here. We need to be careful. And I start barreling down, like a lich. Around. Why didn't you tell us earlier? All right. Because you move forward, Colbert. Yes. While you're moving down there. Yes. Give me a climb check or an acrobatics. I'm moving around. Give me a climb check or an acrobatics. Do I need to do as well if I do it? Yes. Alright. See, it was seven. It's not bad. I it's actually minus. rolled 18 on that. <laughs> oh, yeah. You were fine. I was bad. Samuel, is that climb or acrobatics? Uh, climb. You were fine. Alright. Seems I revived. Anyway. Is there a little, like, a... Yes, you can get through there. Uh, I go after Orin. It, it, the room slopes down, so... Alright. Move there. There must be something with this page, because I can just, like, pull a bunch of pages and go right to the necromancer. So there must <laughs> be something with the book. But yeah, there's, like, a bit of a binding there, so... Hey, I can reveal that little bitty. Is that revealed? Or is that not revealed? This? No. Okay, just a second. Oh yeah, or in clam, clam check or acrobatics. Ready, let me find it. Uh, acrobatics I have points in. Acrobatics. Acrobatics? Acrobatics, yep. Yeah. You begin sliding towards the pool. Whee! I enjoy the slide and land into the pool. You take... 2d6 point, uh, you take 1d6 point of damage and hit the pole. Yay. <laughs> Need a DC 15 swim check to I get it back out. I auto pass. Yep. Uh, However, I actually tried to see whether I can see these fucks in there. No, they're, they're, you might be able to, but they're like really far down, so I don't think you're in dark, how far does your dark vision go? Yeah, 60 feet. Yeah, they're probably if if you can see them, they're just exiting your field of vision. Gotcha. You do not see the bottom. All right, I'll just hop out. Climb First, up again. big ten climbing up. You 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 pass. Oop, my bad. That's actually a four, and that's actually a two because it's minus two, not plus two. Yeah, I kind of. So you see. It's, you see the necromancer go sliding into the pool. Oh god. He we tried. have to rescue him. <laughs> well, some of you can. I mean, I just. Give me the rope. As go, go. soon as possible. He can get out of here, come on, for fuck's sake. And then I start. I mean, the door is destroyed, so we. Do we see anything? Do you leave the, ne the necromancer to drown? No! I'm gonna stop you, Colbert, if you do. So, some, so get to him for fuck's sake! Don't expect me Maybe, to do it. Let me, man, lend me your rope, you fool! I gave him a rope. Stupid fuck. I throw it down you to the You cannot do anything to yourself. I don't have a fucking rope. 
You can go down there and help him out, you know. Anyways, he has the rope. Jesus, fuck. Mm, Orin. Hmm? You're, you're our best swimmer. Go help him. That... I fucking hate you guys. If you walk in there, you see this wonderful man. We have a light down and fucking the skin thumb and oh dear. Oh, hello, Lich. Where's and the directory? The corpse of Aisha yeah. Fox. He 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 kind of he kind of the the outfit looks similar to Aldern. <laughs> to uh uh oh, yeah. that guy. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, it does. What do you know? It's Would almost it like him? they're related or something. It's it, it's almost as if she shouted Eldern's name. It's almost like it is Eldern. Well, Eldern, if that is your true name. <laughs> Good thing I didn't remember that, that spoiler because I, I think I read yeah I read in the past that one of the books introduced character who turned out to be a serial killer. Um, when you get when you get in there, he's sitting in a chair reading a book. But we wait, wait till Orin gets here, but yeah, we'll go in there soon. Yeah. I have so to Orin, save this fuck first. Yeah. So. Yeah. Orin saves that fuck. Okay, <laughs> then climb back up. I mean, yeah, I will go first, and as I'm going in, I'm casting... No, wait. I will cast Protection from Chaos on Orin, and I <laughs> will... Stop it. Yeah? Stop moving. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone is moving. <laughs> Do we roll Nobody initiative? It will be needed, yes. I like that I have like a revived icon on my me still. <laughs> I have returned from the dead. Yes, that's his initiative. Is two D? He rolls two dice for his initiative. What the fuck, man? There's totally not an invisible person inside. Or, you know, it could just be the necros. Hmm. Oh, you were saved. Hmm? He was or saved. Indeed. Yeah. Hmm? He's not no, in the water no. anymore. If he is for you, refresh. No, 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 I said something else. Uh, just. Oh. Anyway. So. What are we gonna do against this scum? Do we have enough rope to tie him up and we can't kill him? Hmm. I still go before Don't him know. if 21 is his initiative. Cool, but. Okay, uh, so, I mean, I would, like, need to, like, see him. Do. And I will... He's sitting there reading a book when you see him. Okay. Uh, he looks, like he looks pretty obviously evil, yes? Yeah, he looks like... So I... You, you, do, do you detect evil? I already did that once, not gonna do it again. He looks fucking evil, he looks like a fucking monster, goddammit. Or do you judge evil uh, by its looks? Uh, He's obviously good, guys. Yeah, what what if I told you he's actually not evil? The, the guy's Skin name's Soul Skin Soul Man. not a fucking chance. What if I told you he is actually not evil? Uh, not believing it. Uh, anyways, as a standard action, I'm gonna apply one of the oil of magic weapon to my. He is totally lawful good. Morning star. <laughs> uh, Colbert, you're gonna get smited by your god for killing him. <laughs> Stop bullshitting me, and that's <laughs> all I'm doing. Mm. So, what does the skin soul man do?
Matt, check your Skype. Uh, so... Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> He's totally my <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so yes, he is chaotic, but he is not evil. I don't exactly care about that. I know. He's a mass murderer, I don't give a fuck if he's neutral. I mean, it will, it will turn out that he's a murderer, but yeah. Is he doing anything? He... Because obviously I mean, he hears me, because my fucking armor is clanging. And, and, what, do you, and what did you say you did? I applied all of magic weapon as a snap adaption oh. to my weapon. He closes his book and looks over at you. Sap. So I suppose the rest of us funnel into the room. Yeah. Next. He, the, yeah. I guess he says something. I, yeah. Let's. Uh, it says, "Welcome to my wonderful laboratory." He says to you. Grinning. Not for long. <laughs> By the way, without heal check, does it does he look like at all injured or just nope. he, he wasn't touched? Not injured at all. Okay. Yeah, because like I mean you can you can say that I don't know and next and I would just do a heal <laughs> check. And that's a standard, but okay. Anyways, I mean, if he's only trading banter, then I don't know. If he attacks me, then he can attack, but. I'm gonna say I, I, I look clearly, like, aggressive. <laughs> and he looks like he doesn't care. Yeah. Simon. Alright, I swagger inside the laboratory. Do you pass Colbert? Yes. He ignored Colbert, walks right past him. Mm. What's up? Ooh. I look at the skin saw man. Get that motherfucker! <laughs> Orin! Alright. Hi. He's still uh, sitting in the chair, not doing anything. I just kind of stand there, like, ready to attack, and then is sitting there, not acting. Or it just kind of lowers his claws, confused. Ah, uh, motherfuck. I think, no, wait, maybe I'm paranoid. Orin is confused. No, 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 I'm not saying that in character, out of character. The necromancer walks in. Test. The out of character, I have a suspicion there's going to be a spell. Real fucking soon. Uh, Who said uh, he was a spellcaster? He's a lich. Who said he was a lich? Hmm. Yeah, I mean oh, we. Yes. I mean, ritual only showed that. I mean, from for our knowledge, we thought it was a lich, but it ca it could be something else. Mm. Oh yeah, the description for this room. You might want that. Sure. The air in this damp cavern reeks of a horrific stench, a foul combination of decay, brine, and mold. The cave contains a rickety table, its damp surface cluttered with all manner of what appears to be garbage, empty bottles, bits of clothing, crumbled bits of paper, and more, lying in neatly organized rows. A painting leans against the far side of the table, facing a large leather chair that sits nearby. This chair's high back and cushion are horribly stained by smears of rotten meat, and its arms are... Sticky with blood. A smaller table sits against the southern wall, its surface heaped with plates and platters of rotten, maggot infested meat. The horrific stench of the room seems to be strongest to the west, where the cave's wall has been overtaken by horrific growth of green of dark green mold and dripping fungi. At the center a patch of black tumescent fungus grows, its horny ridges and tumor like bulbs forming what could almost be taken as a humor in the outline. What appears to have once been an exquisite puzzle box the size of a man's fist lies smashed on the ground at the fungoid shape's feet. Hmm. 
Okay. Uh, I walk over he here and cast guidance on myself. Mm -hmm. All right, Tolbert. Yeah. Um. Hmm. I'm wondering if I wanna do that because to confirm my suspicions that I whispered to you, but that probably might be meta knowledge. So I. Uh, if I if I cast protection from chaos on Orin, would that would you consider that meta knowledge or? Uh, no. That's my domain spell to protect. Feel free. I just like yeah, five foot step here, and cast protection from chaos on Orin. Alrighty. And I know. I know that normally if he's an illusion you need to like strike and will to disbelieve, but is there a way to make like a perception check or something to like see if he's like You can try to actively disbelieve an illusion without like attacking it. That'd just be a will save. Is that a standard action? I'd say yes. Okay, so I cannot do that in this turn. He stands up. Oren, do you take an attack of opportunity? Not. Does he look aggressive at all? No. No. Then no. He like just steps over here and grabs something off the table, which you see is a war razor. Now he's being aggressive. Because he just picked up a weapon and then he says, You live! Well and good, for now I shall have the reward of tasting your heart while it is yet warm. Okay. Alright, killing you both. Alright. Both. Both? He's drunk. Okay. <laughs> I see two of you, don't worry. You see two of him? No, what? no. No, no there's only one. Joke. <laughs> okay, I, I was confused. I was like, wait, what? Something bug up or what? <laughs> there shouldn't be two of him. <laughs> Whoosh. I mean, move action to stand, move action to walk over, move action to pick something up. That's three move actions. So. Yes, it is. <laughs> <laughs> he might as well be two people. <laughs> Simon, he is specifically looking at you when he said that. All right, I walk up to him, look him straight in the eye, and uh, crack my knuckles as I go to, uh, I don't know, should I grapple him or should I not? If you ask me, I'd say just attack. Yeah, just attack. As I punch him in the throat. You talk too much. You hit. With a... Uh, nine damage. You deal nine damage. Tragic. And that's my turn. Mm, that's, that's not too good music. Let's find something else. Ooh, music. Nah, I'm kidding. Let's do this one. All right. Is that all? Orin. Yeah. Okay. Alrighty. Um, can I five foot step over there? Yes. Alrighty. Five foot step over there. 
entering motherfucking rage, and I'm just going to click it, subtract 1 from all of the attack rolls. So, highest is a 19. 19 does not hit. Yeah, thought as much. My rolls today aren't very good. Holy <laughs> shit, there's like threes and twos everywhere. Yeah. What the fuck? Yeah. Zaren's turn. <laughs> no, not the feet, the the spell. <laughs> nope, nope, that one not work. So he just casts Magic Missile. Pew pew pew. Raven Feeblemen on him. That's also a good thing. And actually, no, that fails miserably because that doesn't work against Undead. Yes, it's true. Uh, how would you I've like? Got. How would you like a grease? You kinda don't see him from this point, although no, yeah. maybe. Yeah, I would say that it's. Uh, uh, then I would just simply move a bit further. We. <laughs> grease into the wall. Yes. Or oh. onto his weapon, but that's your. Want to see his roll, or should I hide his roll? Uh, no matter. Up to you. Oh, shit. tragic. Holy shit, he has 12 reflex. <laughs> Although there was a chance that he could fail it, so, you know. Cobra. There's okay, all uh, may I move like this? Yes. Uh, okay. I'm not moving into Greece because heavy armor, Oop. I would probably fail. And I just try to smack him with my magically enhanced morning star, which I will probably yeah not quite yep. and that's my turn Oof. I mean, he's a boss, he has, like, nice AC. Yeah. He just kind of screams at Simon. <laughs> As you see, he's, his shape and form starts to morph into that of Simon's. <laughs> or he just grins at this. Wait, me or Samuel? Samuel. Simon. He looks like Samuel, <laughs> not Simon. But you know what I meant. <laughs> <laughs> Simon, what the fuck? He suddenly gets gets a bad vision. And gets I forgot something that he would do, but okay. Not or him. just grins Someone at this, him. and he said, Simon, oh, Samuel, how, how cute yeah. of you, giving me a chance to beat up Samuel without actually having to beat him up." Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, what? Alright, you may look like me, but you ain't no way you uh, can fight like me. As and then I he just uh, completely destroys you. <laughs> as I do a flurry <laughs> of blows. Nice. Miss. Hit. Miss. Nice. There's no way you can fight like me. Miss, miss, hit. <laughs> 10 damage. Alright, that's my thing. Alright. Five foot step for flanking. Add one to all of these rolls. Twenty-two, twenty, 
and 28. 28 hits. 22 doesn't? All right. Um, I He's undead, right? So no sneak attack. Nope. Right. Uh, 16 damage. Four of which being corrosive. That's my turn. All right. Zarin spotting the west wall and the humanoid shape on it runs towards it and begins shoveling fungus into his mouth. Into his own mouth? Yes. What the Ew. fuck? <laughs> I mean, I don't see that because I'm focusing on the serial killer, but what the fuck? <laughs> He's hungry. Hearts. <laughs> A weirdo. Oh god. A lunatic. Oh, there's a haunt in this room as well. Oh no. God damn it. All Luckily, the hounds are like going at him. <laughs> Only two of them. Yeah, but the one that was most effective went against him. I presume I can hit this guy with only minus four. Well, he is in combat, so. Yeah. Only minus four, not minus eight, because I'm 